How important is art to you? It's very important for me. I have no other life than art and literature. I don't know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> This is Orhan Pamuk. I'm a fiction writer. I've chosen these two Cornell boxes. On the right hand, we have a doll covered by various branches, which gives an effect of a doll forgotten in woods. And we feel sad about this doll. The other one is based on a legend. It's a mid 19th century Italian jewel casket. Cornell has the power to make everyday objects shine with poetry, with an aura that you would not come across in our normal lives. Maybe they're friendlier than a painting because you know, they look like things that you might have in your home or in an attic, or they have a kind of familiarity. They're common objects, as we were just saying. Yes. They're, not, they're not valuable, but they become valuable. Do you have an idea as to why Cornell sort of speaks to you? I do, actually. It generates a desire in me to be close to it, to understand why I like it and why it's so beautiful. Perhaps that's the logic of modern art. We are fascinated by something at the beginning. We don't know why we are fascinated. And many times I thought about how Cornell put these, his objects together, how he continues to look at them and decided this is beautiful, this is not. That you can never understand. That is his secret mystery. <laughs>